This is the Lage Manufacturing Max 31 Mark II. It is a Suomi drum upper for use with the SWD M119 submachine gun. It is chambered in 9mm and uses 72 round Suomi M31 drum magazines or 50 round Suomi coffin magazines. The 36 round stick magazines are not compatible. It is manufactured from built aluminum and is about a half pound lighter than the Max 31 Mark I. Due to its longer bolt stroke and better balance, it makes an excellent platform for shooting subgun competitions. We also make a Max 31A Mark II drum upper for the M11A1 380 guns. This allows the 380 submachine gun to shoot 9mm. This upper will work with M11A1 380 guns that have either the small magazine well or the larger mag well for Zytel mags. In this video, we will be focusing on the features of the Max 31 Mark II, but the same features are on the Max 31A Mark II upper as well. The primary difference of the M11-9 and the M11A1-380 is that the rear of the receiver of the M11A1 is about 2 inches shorter than the M11-9. The Max 31 Mark II features a side cocking, non-reciprocating charging handle with spring return. The mag release is ambidextrous and easy to operate. Just grab the drum, squeeze the mag release, and pull the drum free. The foregrip is designed to be long enough to comfortably hold the gun with the drum mag installed. The foregrip is integral to the upper receiver and features a hand stop and bottom accessory rail. There are additional mounting points on the left and right sides of the gun for adding additional rails. This is what the Max 31 Mark II looks like with the side accessory rails and our forward canted K-grip installed. The upper features a full length Picatinny rail along the top for attaching removable sights or an optic. The upper comes standard with an 8 and 3 8 inch barrel installed with a birdcage flash hider. Standard threading is half 28. Additional threading options are available including HK3 lug. To install the Max 31 Mark II, make sure your firearm is clear first. Make sure the safety is off. Remove the retaining pin. Remove the upper receiver. Pull the trigger while you're installing the Max 31 upper. Reinstall the retaining pin. and you're good to go. To fire the Max 31 Mark II, pull back on the charging handle, insert a magazine, aim and fire. For those of you that want a more aggressive rate of fire, we offer the Variable Buffer System, or VBS. This increases the rate of fire from the standard 700 RPM to 710 or 800 RPM, depending on how many buffer spacers you install and what ammo you use. To install the VBS, make sure the weapon is clear. Remove the upper receiver and remove the bolt assembly. With the bolt laying with the top side up, pull the ejector rod from behind the recoil plate. The VBS has marking on it. Make sure it is right side up and place it behind the bolt. Reinsert the ejector rod through the VBS and into the bolt. Reinstall the bolt into the upper receiver. Reinstall the upper to the lower. And reinstall the retaining pin. Two VBS can be installed in the Max 31 Mark II, but only one VBS can be installed in the Max 31A Mark II. The standard rate of fire for the Max 31A is 700 RPM. With one VBS installed, the rate of fire is 760 RPM. This is the Max 31 Mark II with the standard bullet. Now with one VBS installed. And now with two VBS installed. This is the Max 31A Mark II with the standard bullet. Now with one VBS installed.
the rate of fire is dependent on the power of the ammo being used. So your rate of fire may vary. Weaker ammo will shoot slower, and more powerful ammo will shoot faster. If you'd like to order one of these upper receivers, please email us at sales at max11.com or go to our website, lagemfg.com.